Hello, and thank you so much for clicking play. You are about to watch some gameplay video of Guild Wars 2. Uh, the class I'm still playing is Mesmer, and this is uh, levels 10 through 15. I hope you enjoy, and remember, if you do like what you are seeing, please hit that like button. And uh, again, I will be constantly putting out more videos, so also subscribe too, if you don't mind. And if you have any questions or you want to be, you know, want to criticize me, that's cool. That's cool. Just remember, I bruise a little easy, okay? So just be nice. I'm still new. I'm still new to YouTube, and I'm still wet behind the ears, y'all. All right? Um, but if you got some nice things to say, please, I would like to read them too as well. All right, thanks again, and uh, enjoy. Okay. Roll that video, please. Why are you looking at me? Hit the video, man. Just roll it. What, what are you doing? People are waiting. I'm sorry. <sighs> Enjoy. Roll it. Man, don't make me get up. I'm about to get up. You guys don't want to see this. I, I got to go correct somebody. Excuse me. Okay, uh, as we left off, I was level 10, but now I'm level 11, and all I had to get uh, to do to get that level 11, uh, due to me, of course, going throughout the city and collecting all these points, uh, I got all the waypoints, got all the, the Vista maps, and all these points of interest, and that gave me a treasure chest, and that treasure chest also gave me this, let me show you in my bag, it gave me, where is it? Where is it? I don't see it. It's not in my bag anymore. It's not in my bag. Oh, here it is. Right here. It's a transmission chart. So I'm not sure what that does exactly, but we're going to open that up and see. But it also gave me like 970 some experience points, which kicked me over to level 11. I also picked up my first profession skill, which was, which is tailoring. Since I use light armor, I'm thinking, hmm, hmm, why not? Why not pick it up? So I, that's what I did. I picked it up. Um, I op also like is I open up a bunch of bags, and I can deposit all these bags, that stuff I get out of these bags, right into my bank, my materials bank. So you get these little bags here. Like, you see the seven tiny supply bags? I just double-click on it, and I get all the stuff. I, I got a uh, juke. Uh, scraps, leather uh, selection scraps, and all this other stuff to make stuff with. So I automatically deposit it. Might as well. Uh, get all the deposits I can. Uh, I can destroy that. Uh, yeah. So anything that I can use to make stuff, I'm going to go automatically deposit it. So it, it frees up my bag, which is fantastic. I love that. Because, man, your bags fill up so quickly. Like, like ridiculously quickly. Uh, now, let's see what this does. Okay, we double-click on it. Okay, it's a charge. I'm not sure what that does. Oh, okay. Uh, you purchased via the Black uh, Lion Trading Companies. Spent in wardrobe and changing appearances. Oh, so that's all it does. Okay, so whenever I want to decide to change my appearance, I can do that. Okay, I got a uh, personal story unlocked. Weapons, okay, we already know that. Let's, let's click on this again. I get five hero points. And where I can use, holy moly, this just game just opened up even more. Okay, signet training, mantra training, manipulation training, glamour training, illusions training. Where do I begin? Oh, look at this. Okay, this summons two clones to attack your foes. Oh. It breaks enemies targeting and it stuns. That is nice. Phantasm Defender, Decoy, Clone, Gain Stealth, Summons, Illusion to Attack Your Foes. Oh my god! What? 
Oh, yes, yes, yes. Mirror image. Guys, you know, I think I might like this. I'm going to grab that. I'm going to grab this one right here. Take it. Yes, I'll spend the points for that. And that gives it to me right here. Awesome. Oh, we're going to have clones out the yin yang. I'm not sure what other points I need to spend just yet. So let's take our time, get to know our character a little bit better. I'm going to bring this up and bring up my crafting. All right. Oh, guys, look, I can actually make eight slot bags. Oh, we are cooking, y'all. We're cooking. We're doing good. Okay, so what we need to do is go to, uh, yeah, there we go, a tailoring station. And I can automatically make me three of these bags. I'm with that. I don't know about you guys, but I'm with that. So let's go ahead and craft three. Get that done. And I'm leveling up. Okay, I, I leveled up to uh, Novice Taylor 4. But that's not what I'm happy about, guys. Because guess what? Your boy, uh, 8 slot. 8 slot. 8 slot bags. Okay, guys, I am here right now about to get into my story quests. And let's go ahead. Hopefully we'll find something uh, very exciting. Uh, so far, I'm liking the Mesmer class. Time to make those louts pay for ruining your party. I've got my good sword, sensible shoes, and my fighting coiffure. What else do I need? You're as ready as you'll ever be. Glad to have you with me. But do me a favor. Stay close. That way we can protect each other. Don't worry about me. Swordmaster Bongo the One-Eyed told my parents I was the best student he'd ever seen. Uh, hence that he's like one-eyed, so how good is this teacher? Alright. Alright, we're supposed to search the house for kidnapped people. Well, let's go upstairs. Supply crate. Alright. I'm not picking anything up. Had a bomb in there. Right? Maybe the bomb would have maybe came in handy, but all right. Where to keep most kidnapped people? Probably in the basement. Are you sure it's safe here? We left a lot of wounded behind. Yeah. I didn't mean to do that. Let's keep it going. I just let I just let my clones do the work. Does that make me a lazy player? Let's 
Kane, baby. Here we go. That was game. Man, that, that dude got worked pretty quickly. Please, I need your help. Looks like someone's come to kill me, boys. Yeah, just a little bit. Nice try. Nice try. But again, we can switch. trouble save me save me all right good switch that weapon baby all right that was a nice little tactical move man you know sometimes you just gotta back up Yeah, I got you. Please, I need your help. Thank the gods you came along. What can I do for you? I need to open this. Thank the gods you came along. Of course. That's what I do. This is just a bad dream. Bad dream. Bad dream. That's okay. Right? I'll take my time to help her. Thank you so much, both of you. I'll never forget this. You're still in danger. Gather the others and head down that tunnel. You can escape through the abandoned farmhouse. And if you know any fair maidens, be sure to tell them who rescued you. The dashing Lord Farron and his friend. Just get yourself and the others to a safe place. That's all the thanks we need. Speak for yourself, old chum. Before I go, take these documents. I lifted them from the bandits when they were manhandling me. They mentioned some kind of leader in Divinity's Reach. Is that helpful? It is indeed. Thank you. Now please go. We'll make sure you get out of here safely. Go this way. I wish my clones could be like, hey, yo, give me a little protection. Like, like, look, dude, don't concentrate on me. Concentrate on the clones, please. Like, they weren't concentrating on my clones for nothing, y'all.
Get it. Come on, guys. Did they run up ahead? Captain Thackeray, we've had the most marvelous adventure. My friend and I defeated these delinquents with panache and a plum. You're just in time to celebrate our victory. I'm amazed. And again, I should have known the hero of Shaymor wouldn't let your kidnapping go unanswered. No one hurts my friends without answering to me. And look, we found this letter in the bandit cave. Someone in Divinity's Reach is pulling their strings. No common thug would use such expensive parchment. There's a paper maker at the trading post named Sin Furserai. Terribly prickly man, but I bet he could identify the design. Captain Thackeray, let me talk to the paper maker. I'll get the information you need without anyone realizing the Seraph are aware of the traitor in the city. A solid plan. I'm grateful for the help, but be careful. Whoever's behind this plot is playing rough. I'll be waiting in the city to hear what you find. I'll try to keep Farron out of trouble between here and Divinity's Reach. No promises, though. Okay, we uh, finished that quest. Um, and, and if I had to rank that quest right there from like let's say one to five and one being the lowest, five being the highest, I'm gonna give it about a three. Uh due to I almost died. If I didn't almost die, I probably would rank it down like a two. Um The story is progressing. Um I'm still looking forward to finding out more. Uh but let's pick out a new weapon, huh? Guys, I can use a gun? Guys, guys, I can use a pistol. Oh, it's an offhand. It's an offhand, okay. I am curious, but I wanna try out the staff, so let's do that. And we are close to level 12. All right, guys, I am back with uh, still doing a story quest, and we're about to do the, uh, I guess this would be like the third part of it. Let's go ahead and see what we have to do. And mind you, I also switched to a staff now, so I'm, I'm hoping that staff is pretty nice. So what did I switch to? Uh, two-handed, two-handed. Uh, let's... Switch that out. Uh, I don't want to do two handed, two handed. I rather. Switch. We're going to do this. And we'll also do the sword. All right, so we're good. We had a deal, you thick-headed sap. You said centaurs. You didn't mention catapults. Double the pay or we're leaving. Double? How am I supposed to make a profit when you charge so much? Forget it. I don't see that you have much of a choice, little man. money grubbing Norn. You'd spend it all on ale anyway. How in Melandru's name am I supposed to get these supplies back to the city? I guess that's where I come in. You there. You look like you can handle yourself in a fight. I need to get to the garrison, and my oafish guards just turned coward. What do you cost? Cost? I'm not a mercenary. 
I'm here to ask for help identifying the craftsmanship of a piece of handmade paper. If you found quality paper in Divinity's Reach, I can assure you, I made it. Reams of paper are like snowflakes. I know my pages as well as most people know their children. Can you tell me who bought a particular piece of paper? I'm investigating the matter for the Seraph. Yes, I could. But why should I? I'm a resident of Lion's Arch. Your queen's got no authority over me. And my clients expect discretion. Please, it's very important. Can you make an exception? I'll make you a deal. The road to Shaymore is dangerous these days. Protect me until I reach the garrison, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Let's get started. I need this information as soon as possible. No! An escort quest! No! No, I hate escort quests. Oh man, I can't stand escort quests. Oh! At least this one is moving out. He's running. At least he's. Oh, really? Okay, that at least that worked out. I, I'm the staff is not too bad. I gotta figure out what the staff does. From what? I mean, you're getting all kinds of stuff coming at you, bro. Nasty spiders. Alright, the staff is a little slow, but I do I still like it though. I still like it. What's this do? Protect me. I got you, dude. Stay in it. Stay in it. Woo! I'm liking the staff, y'all. I'm not gonna lie. I like the staff so far. Protect me. I mean, it is keeping me alive, y'all. I might have to. I want to try to brandish a, a side pistol. A uh, pistol. That's a pistol. A pistol. Now this has got to be one of the best escort quests I've had because this dude has been running. Thank you. Thank you for not going slow and walking. Thank you, Arena Net. Thank you. The centaurs have erected catapults. Secure the gates. You can't make me stay out here. The centaurs will eat me. Our orders are to seal the gates until those catapults have been destroyed. Why are you wasting time? Destroy those catapults. I'm on it, I guess. Let's get it. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, I got it.
Next. I, I like it. It gives a bleeding effect, but it also gives me booms. So it's giving me some kind of buff. about that life buddy you're not about that life all right we got a bunch here all right let's get it I'm <laughs> not ready for me you're not ready Sorry about your luck, buddy. And done. Easy. Easy. up my end of the bargain you're safe now tell me who bought this paper safe barely <laughs> I feel like I was run over by a herd of marauding doliacs that paper was made of pulp from the severine tree it's one of a kind I sold it to minister Zaman he has exceptional taste thank you that's all I needed to know you might be called as a witness if Zaman is brought to trial so don't leave divinity's reach how very quaint if the Ministry sends a formal summons, I'll come. At least they'll use decent parchment on the subpoena. I'm still doing... my quest. Okay, so I gotta go all the way back. Alright, but like I said, I love it where you could just click on the map, go to a waypoint, boom. I'm there where I gotta be. I hope I click the right one. I hope I'm close to where I need to be. Okay, I am. That's good. All right, so we're continue on. So lots of stories. Lots of stories. Ah, the captain. I've been hoping to see you again. Do you have any news? What did the paper maker say? Furserai admitted he made the paper from Minister Zaman. He also agreed to testify to that effect. I knew Zaman was shady, but organized crime? Setting up citizens to be robbed and brutalized? That's out and out treason. Nevertheless, he's a government official. I can't call him to trial without more evidence. Oh, where are my manners? Allow me to introduce Countess Anise, Master Exemplar of the Shining Blade. Minister Wee is hosting a party tonight. It'll be a good opportunity to eavesdrop on ministers, their allies, and their enemies. Well, we could search Zayman's house. The law allows that if someone's in danger, or if we suspect treason. All right. We have one shot, so it's either the party or Zayman's house. I can't give you orders, so let me know how you want to proceed. Okay. Should we go to the party? I feel like a party. Or should we go to this house? Oh. Uh, we probably should go to the dude's house and we can probably find some information. I, I'm not sure going to the party is going to find me that much. So let's, let's go to his house. We're going to go to his house. We're going to look for evidence. Your fellow nobles seem to have a knack for making my life interesting. Let's see if we can determine. All right. Okay. Uh, these are all light. Eh, 
Uh, this kind of give me a little dapper, a little dapperness to it. Oh, toughness, power, or vitality. You know what? I'm all about that power, baby. Give me the power. Let me start nuking. And uh, let's see, essence of luck, and we get more three bags of loot. So I'm gonna click this. All right, people, we just hit level twelve. That's what's up. Um, let's go ahead and put on this new, some, this new fancy duds. Let's see how I look now. Let's see how I look. Uh. Doesn't quite go well with my bottoms. My bottoms needs a little work. Needs a little work, guys. Just <clears throat> I like the top. The top is not too bad. Top is not too bad, y'all. For real, for real. The top is not too bad. But the, the bottom, man, it just needs a lot of work. But what do we got here? Okay, select. I get some more rewards. Crew salvage kit. Oh, okay. I'm partial to red. I like red. Level two, y'all guys. I'm cooking, y'all. I'm cooking. That boy, good. We'll deposit. You know what? I might switch. I might hook this up and just take a bit, bring it a two-handed weapon. So I'll be two-handing it all the time. I might. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not. I'm not quite sold yet okay we are here at the next part of our story when we're still going it's still only level 10 uh, it says level 10 so it knocks me my uh, my level down each time I go into the story quest so I'm not OP and everything yeah. Yeah. sometimes I want to be OP you know I want to go in there and just wreck everything in my in my way but Let's keep on with the story. Now we are searching this dude's house for clues, I guess. You take the lead. You got your back. Oh, are you, you going to let me go in first? He's here. What you doing? What you doing? Y'all start a fight? Stay alert and be swift but thorough. If Zayman is a traitor, we'll find proof of it here. What are we looking for? Suspicious papers or letters, anything that links him to the bandit attacks. Keep your eyes open and your senses sharp. If you find anything breakable, break it. This dandy needs a few more setbacks in his life. <laughs> this dandy. Salad force is worth more than my annual salary. All these little things make me afraid to turn around. Hey, look at this fancy cup. Think it makes wine taste better? Another's chance. Don't move. With our luck, there will break something, and the boss will bring us both. It has historical, financial, and sentimental value. Yeah. It just so happens the Coronas were robbed recently. How unlucky that Zayman found their. This is the only house the thieves aren't going to ransack. We're paid to pretend. Do your job and act like you're guarding something. I've got a better idea. I'm taking a nap. Wake me when it's your turn. <laughs> the blueprint Were you paying attention? Why bother? You always fill me in. Stop them. We about to get down. All right, let's do it. There you go. You just got work, son. Army of one. Oh, 
Y'all not ready. Y'all not ready for me. Y'all not ready. Army of one, baby. Army of one. This is the dude. Zayman's here. Now I can arrest him for his part in this, and he can rot in prison. Wait, treating him like a common criminal only creates more problems. Political problems. We have to do this formally, by the book. You sound like a niece, but you're right. We'll issue a subpoena and warn the gate guards. If he tries to run, we'll bring him in. What's going on here? What are you doing in my house? As captain of the Seraph in the service of Her Royal Majesty Queen Jenna, I call you to trial. What? This is outrageous. On what charge? Treason against the crown and citizens of Divinity's Reach. Pray for Cormier's mercy, Zayman. You're gonna need all the help you can get. All right. Oh, shoot. Okay, I get a long sword and some more stuff. So I'm gonna pick the long sword and I'll accept that. Hey, we're almost level 13, y'all. We're doing this. Okay, uh, we are now here at the next part for the trial. Uh, let's see what happens. This is still a, a level 10 quest, story quest. What? Ministers only beyond this point. Dang. Did you just push me? Hey. Oh, Citizen. Okay. Okay. What the? <laughs> huh. I mean, dang, I mean, they, I mean, they pushed me pretty hard. Our witnesses have arrived. Are you ready to present the case? As a noble, you are our best representative. I've gone over everything a dozen times. Unless something goes horribly wrong, we'll get our man. At this rate, Queen Jen is guaranteed to notice you. If nothing else, I'll make sure your name reaches her ears. Minister Codicus is waiting. Signal him when you're ready. Good luck. And may Lyssa bless you with unparalleled eloquence. I like the way you talk. Accusing a minister of treason? It's preposterous. A lot of people here. May Cormier enlighten you. Hear ye, the trial of Minister Julius Zaman is hereby called to order. Legate Minister Codicus presiding. Who stands for the prosecution? I do, Your Honor. We have evidence proving Minister Zayman conspired against the citizens of Divinity's Reach. He abused his authority to commit thievery, murder, and treason. We will present incriminating documents and sworn testimony from respected members of the community, including the sister of the accused. The prosecution seems to have prepared quite a compelling case. Minister Zayman, can you refute these dire accusations? Refute? Why bother? My lord Codicus, in accordance with the most ancient tenets of Crichton law, I invoke my right to trial by combat. This court accepts your invocation. By law and custom, you may choose a second to fight with you in the circle. Thank you, Legate Minister. I choose my retainer, Idol the Unlovable, as my second. The prosecution must also nominate a principal and a second. Or forfeit the case. I will be the principal, Legate Minister. I'd like to request a short recess to select my second. Granted, when the prosecution is ready to continue, this court will reconvene and the trial by combat will begin. 
Okay. As a seraph captain, I can't really jump around saying, pick me, pick me. Who should we choose? Should we choose her? Or would you choose my boy? Hmm. 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 Let me. Hmm. Yeah, him. I'm on duty. Alright, so. I wonder what she'll say. Okay. Oh, and there's my boy back here. What are you doing here? I didn't know you were interested in judicial Melissa matters. Melissa Aiden. Thackeray had me identify All right. Selma's stolen chalice this morning. So, I know who I'm choosing. I'm choosing the captain. Captain Thackeray. Come on down. We're ready to begin, Legate Minister. I have chosen my second. An interesting choice. For the record, let it be known that this duo will continue until both members of one side surrender or are defeated. If Lord Zaman proves victorious, he is innocent. The case is thrown out and these charges against him may not be brought again. If you win, then Zaman is found guilty of this crime. I understand. When you're in position, the trial by combat shall proceed. Good luck to you all. May justice prevail. All right, trial by combat, baby. Trial by combat. Oh, damn. Okay. Ho! We starting. Damn! That hurt. Get on him, get on him, get on him. Alright, we got him. We're bleeding. It's too much, too much for you, buddy. It, uh, I'm a one man army. Victory is declared. According to the dictates of Crichton law, Minister Zaman is found guilty. Minister Codicus does not look happy. He doesn't like anything to infringe on the rights of ministers. Trial by combat took the judgment out of his hands. Did it? How do you think Zaman knew about the ancient law in the first place? He's no historian. You think Codicus advised Zaman about the clause? If Zaman won the battle, he'd be declared innocent. No more investigation. Now he's guilty, but he's also dead. No loose ends. Never underestimate Minister Codicus. Hmm. At least we know the identity of Zaman's backer. Go and celebrate a well-earned victory. Anise and I will be in touch with you. Genuinely hoping for a conviction based on a preponderance of the evidence. Okay, we won the trial by combat, and hopefully we'll get something good. Oh, do I get all of these? I'll get all of this. Okay, I accept. What's next? All right, guys, we are now level thirteen. Okay, so personal uh, story chapter two will not begin until I get to at level 20. When did this open up? Level 15, okay. And we are done with this part of the story. Uh, so we won't be able to continue on until I get to level 20 and the personal story uh, apparently will open back up and we can 
of course, continue this wonderful story. So far, I am a little interested to find out what's going on, especially with that uh, that other guy working behind the scenes. So uh, I guess I'll just continue on in the world and keep on pushing. I threw the bones this morning. According to Grinth, we're in for a safe journey. It's a sign from Landru. We need to leave right this minute. Okay, now we have another escort quest. No! Of course, they want to walk around very slowly. Hey, what's that? Trouble. Let's get it. Strong. Script. I don't know about divine tests, but I'd say your scrying failed. It's good we have another player out here to help me out. I mean, to feel my pain of them walking slowly to their destination. Look, guys, it's... Centaurs it... are raiding the ale supply. My friends are drunken idiots, but they don't deserve this. I can't help you. No, no, let's, you know, let's literally take our time. Let's just, let's do that. You're in danger, so let's just let's just stroll our happy butts. There we go. Finally, some action. Some action, y'all. Why am I? Why am I not attacking? Hello. There you go. Let's get it together now, people. Let's get it together. Oh, this is a level 10 uh, quest. Finally, some action, y'all. Get him. He's like taking too many hits. Whoops. I didn't mean to get that. Back off, pig. Always keep your head on a swivel. Come on, let's get to where we need to go. There we go. Here come more of these monsters. I will live on. Mm. Nah. <clears throat> <laughs> 
<clears throat> Army of one, baby. Army of one. Hey, I think I'm about to hit level 15 in a few. Almost done with this community type quest. I'm not even sure what you call it. That's it. That is it. I have finally made level 15, y'all. And that's where we'll end it right there uh, because uh, we need to do some uh, some crafting and we need to get some uh, new skills at parent because this opened up. So once again, thank y'all so much for stopping in. Uh, not just stopping in, actually just clicking that play button and watching me play this game um, from level 10 to 15. Uh, I cannot thank you enough for even watching the video. Uh, again, if you like what you see, uh, please hit that thumbs up. Please smash it, destroy it, obliterate that sucker, please. And hit that subscribe button because you know what? I'm going to keep pumping out videos, all right? It, God willing, I'm going to keep doing it. All right, y'all already know the deal. Two fingers. Peace. I'm out of here. See y'all next time, all right? Take care, guys. Later.